Hi, welcome to Radio 1 Movies with me, Rihanna. Not many films out this week. We've got By the Sea, which stars Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt, and a film called Grandma. But let's start with By the Sea. This is a drama set in the south of France about a writer who can't write and his wife who seems to hate him. And then she discovers this spy hole into their newlywed neighbour's room and their shenanigans sort of ignite her own relationship. Angelina Jolie wrote, directed, produced and stars in this with her real-life husband, Brad Pitt. In the film, their relationship is very volatile, but sparks do fly. There is chemistry there, although I thought he was a little bit stilted at the beginning and then seemed to relax. It's all about the style of this film, though, and I loved watching Angelina Jolie move on screen. She arches her back and stretches out her feet a lot. It's intoxicating to watch her. And even the scenery is seductive. Everything is very deliberate and beautiful. The plot isn't that exciting and actually quite predictable so if you go and see it go and see it for the look rather than the action three stars for by the sea next up it's grandma a granddaughter goes to her grandma asking for money for an abortion for later that day so the whole film is this grandma trying to scrape around money from favors that she's owed from people from her past so can you loan me the money sure okay i want something to return though what what do you want a kiss <laughs> Uh, you mean like a peck? No, like a kiss. A real kiss. And then you'll loan me the, the money? Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Let's get it over with. This is quite a dark comedy. This grandma, played to perfection by Lily Tomlin, is brilliant at giving people a piece of her mind. She's got an incredibly sharp tongue, which is where all the humor comes from. The dialogue is excellent. She doesn't care what anyone thinks about her. She's a poet, she's a lesbian, and she's very liberal. And it was really encouraging to see a film about abortion coming out of America, which isn't judgmental and stuck to his guns. It's a film about mistakes, unconditional love, and acceptance. So four stars for grandma. Next week, it is all about Star Wars The Force Awakens. Can you believe it? It's finally here. And I'll also be reviewing Sisters starring Tina Fey and Amy Poehler.